Boozy Tubies, the king of the OG fake pranks, really started the fakeness on YouTube, the godfather of faking stuff on YouTube. Boozy Tube right here, he's back on the internet, and he's the most talked about streamer today. We're on the new streaming platform, Kick. He had 70,000 viewers. Now, that's just insane. But here's the thing with Fousey, like the people watching Fousey, they're really watching Fousey to wait for him to have another mental breakdown. I mean, this guy right here is insane in the head. And you know what? I'm, I'm not even here to make fun of him, but what he did today, bro, this guy is stupid. He's dumb as hell, bro. I've never seen anything like this on stream, bro. We got to go to what he's been doing to get his name talked about in the air. And as you know, they say not all publicity is good publicity. And Fousey 2 really takes that to the head, bro. He just wants to get his name out there no matter what he does, bro. He's been slapping everyone. He's been making, bro, he's been picking on little kids, bro. All right, look, I say little kids. I know Jack Dottery is 19 and I know Neon's probably like 19, 20, 20, whatever, bro. Listen, Neon is a little kid, bro. I don't care what you say. Neon is a little kid, bro. You should not be picking on Neon, bro. But go pick on someone your own size, Fousey. Look, Fousey slapped this mess out of Neon because Neon's character, you know Neon's character, Neon's character is just to talk shit on people, bro. So Neon starts talking shit to Fousey, Fousey smacks him and bitches Neon, and then Fousey feels good about it. I think you're perfect. You're not. You're far from perfect. You got a fucked up ass too. Fousey, Neon is a buck ten soaking wet. You are three times his size, and you want to pick on the littlest guy in the room, Fousey. I promise you. You wouldn't have slapped no real ass nigga in that room because any real ass nigga you would have slapped, they would have fucking slapped you back. Bro, you slap, bro. You slapping niggas, bro? For fame? You done lost your mind, bro. And I'm mad because this internet stuff got motherfuckers thinking backwards. Like, bro, if someone puts their hands on you, you put your hands on them back. And Neon nor Jack Dottery did nothing to Fousey. Oh, yeah. Here's the Jack Dottery video, bro. Beta. God damn it. Beta said, hey. Yo, you're a bitch. I'm beta. I'm actually 33 years old. I'm and yo, get me some water bottles, John. Hey, now we can't bust. There's a whole. I mean, this guy just a cocky asshole, bro. He gets back on top of the world again. He had, after he lost everything, he's had a depression episodes, manic fucking brain aneurysms, whatever he's had, bro. I don't know what he's had, but he's been having mental stuff going on for forever, bro. He's been doing YouTube for 12 plus years, and he's he's had millions of dollars, lost it all. Now he's back at the top, about to get this kick deal to get millions, right? Then he slaps both these motherfuckers in the face, bro. Slaps the shit. Out of Neon slaps the shit out of Jack Daughtery. And the thing is, he's not slapping these people because he's mad or anything at them, though. He's slapping them to get his name out there. So, yeah, Fousey gets his name out there. Woo! -hoo 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 -hoo! Let's go. Fousey, you're on top of the world again. Let's go. Kick deal coming. 80 million coming your way. Guess what Fousey does today, bro? The most insane thing I've ever seen in my life. This is worse than the July 15th incident where he promised everyone Drake and then blue balled them. Yeah, that's just a little theory I have. Maybe he, I, I think he called him the bomb threat because he couldn't promise Drake, but you know, apparently someone else called him the bomb threat. But today, Fousey messed up. Messed up bad. You know how, uh, you know how, you know, your favorite streamer gets swatted. You know, someone on the other side of the screen will call in a swatter on your favorite streamer. Hey, uh, uh, Aiden Ross, he's, he's over here at the KFC. He has a girl held up hostage at the KFC. He's, uh, by the dumper in the deep fryer. Go, go arrest this motherfucker. Then, you know, the police go to the KFC and, hey, put your hands up. Well, Fousey called in a swat on himself, pretty much. Basically what happened July 15th. Questions? Send the cops send the cops there's a gun to my head right now there's a gun to my head help ma'am 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 ma he left ma'am he left there's a gun to my head help help get them help bye ma'am intercontinental what's my room number help tell me 20 now i used to do prank calls but i never had the balls to prank call the police or call a swat in on someone so i mean that's it's impressive, Fousey. You call the SWAT in on yourself. You're the most idiotic person I've ever seen this year. But look, uh, here's the story. So, apparently Fousey was being stalked. Someone called up into his room and was like, Hey, uh, I know where you're at. Are uh, you ready for the night? I'm gonna come up there and I'm gonna hurt you. This, you know, people troll when you're a live streamer. So people were trolling Fousey. Well, not people. One person was trolling Fousey. Calling him into his hotel, saying he knew where he was. Fousey got scared. Even though he's been through this millions of other times before while, you know, being an IRL streamer, people have been trolling him this whole time. But this time he got really scared, called the police, and made a false report saying there was a gun to his head. Just wasting the cops time. The cops can't do anything about someone trolling because they don't know who it is that's trolling. So you're going to make the cops go out to you, waste their time when there's probably someone being murdered 
are being motherfucking abused somewhere. And you're making them come out to your idiotic ass. Well, as soon as the cops walked into his hotel room, they smelt the bluff from a mile away. They smelt it walking up to that hotel room. They're like, all right, man, this guy's an idiot. This guy's crazy. Uh, we gonna arrest him. Yeah, let's arrest this guy. And Fousey, uh got arrested. Thank God. The guy needs help, all right? He doesn't need to be out in the world right now. The guy needs... While you're sitting in this jail cell, Fousey, I hope there's someone in there, like a like an enlightener, to fucking help this up here. Because the way you're going about it, to, you know, the way you're going about streaming, the way you're going about trying to get famous, Fousey, nigga, you are 33 years damn old. 33! 33! You know how old that is? You're almost LeBron's age. And you're doing this? Nigga, you're not 23. You're not 19. You're 33. Bro, go find you a wife. Make a family. Bro, listen, fools, you don't need to be doing all this, bro. Go back to vlogging. Like, bro, what, what, what are you doing acting like you're a 19 year old, bro? I'm 19 trying to give you advice. I shouldn't be giving you advice. You should be giving me advice, nigga. Here. He can't come inside. He can't come in. Y'all are I'm suing all y'all. My life is in danger and you arrest a Palestinian Muslim who's viral? Are y'all dumb or are you stupid? You're hey! Hey, free Fousey! Hashtag free Fousey! Fousey, I don't think that's why they arrested you because you're a viral Palestinian Muslim. I think I could give a shit less what you are, bro. I think they arrested you because you broke the law. You ever thought about that? Maybe uh, if you break the law... You go to jail. So yeah, Fousey just sitting in jail right now for making a false report to the police. And once he gets out of jail, he's probably going to have 90,000 viewers. And that kick deal is probably still coming from. I'm not going to say his career is over. But all I'm saying is that the internet's not for everyone, bro. The internet is not for everybody. I mean, this dude is on the internet breaking, having a mental breakdown every damn day, crying in front of all his viewers. Bro, your viewers do. I mean, your viewers want to see that. Most viewers don't want to see that. But your viewers literally watch you, Fousey, too, because they want to see you fall again and it's sad bro I'm, I, I don't i don't watch you because of that bro i'm trying to help you nigga i try to help people bro but your viewers watch you because they want to see you fail bro they want to see you go crazy they want to see you lose your money they want you to have another july 15th episode and it's looking like it's happening again fuji tube is losing his mind again i'm not gonna lie as long as he keeps doing the crazy stuff he's doing and keeps slapping people for no reason He's gonna keep viewers, bro, because people want to see that, bro. You know, people like drama. You know how the world is, bro. But if you guys enjoyed the video, smack a like, subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Stay tuned for some more vids, man. We grinding all year. We grinding all next year. We grinding the year after that. We grinding the year after that. Nigga, I'm staying on YouTube. I'm here to stay, man. You know what I'm saying? So you know what? Subscribe. None of them up. None of them stuck. Ain't no more love. Carries up my ear, but I could have bought a trash,